key. You don't want it with the Howard Juga Barbie. Keep a mark key, everything's sparkly. It's Barbie. What's up, Barbies? That's what Nicki Minaj calls her fans. This is a Nicki Minaj inspired look. I actually saw her wear this to her birthday party with Trina. I think she threw a couple of them and I don't remember which one it was. I know I remember seeing her in a picture with Soldier Boy. Anyway, the look jumped out at me because it's pastel but it was really pretty and I love the fact that she wears bold color. I love the fact that she plays with makeup. She's one of the few uh, women of color who I really see go there with makeup. So I decided to recreate it because I really liked it. And I'm going to show you what it looks like so that you can see what I'm talking about. So you can see it's really, really bright. Um, the eyes are pastel, but they have impact. The lip, bright pink, pink blush. So stay tuned, and I hope you guys enjoy the tutorial. Okay, so let me go over what I have on my face so far. First, I have Select Cover Up, and I use that as a foundation. This is NC45. I applied it with a dampened cosmetic sponge. Next, I applied Ben Nye Banana Powder with a dampened cosmetic sponge. I also applied NARS Casino with an angled Sephora blush brush. First, you want to apply a base to your eye. I'm going to use Urban Decay Primer Potion. Okay. Now, I applied the Urban Decay Primer Potion first because this is a creamy base and it will crease if you don't put something under it. So, Next, I'm going to take my Ben Nye Cream Color in white, and you can use NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil and Milk. So now I'm going to come in with my first color, and all the colors I'm going to be using with the exception of one is going to be for my 88 palette. So, this is the... 88 palette and I actually have a diagram in the sidebar to explain which colors I'm going to be using. I am going to take my MAC 239. I'm going to come in with this color right here. And that's going to go on the first half of my eye. Next, I'm going to come in with my 217 and blend that out a little bit. Now I'm going to take the other side of my brush and come back in with this really pretty blue right here. And that's going to go on the other half. And again with my 217 and blend it out. And blend the two together. Now I'm going to add my crease colors. So I'm going to be using this purple right here. And if you notice when I'm applying these colors, I'm really patting them on instead of sweeping them. Okay, so to deepen that crease color, I'm going to apply this blue.
Now I'm going to come back with my 224 oops, and blend those together. So now I'm going to take that crown brush and apply some color in my inner crease. And the first color I'm going to use is this pink right here. And you want to make sure to take the color toward the bridge of your nose. And then to deepen up this color, I'm going to take this hot pink right here. Again with my 224 and blend. And blend that purple and pink together. I'm going to come back in with a little bit more of that lighter seafoam color. And just come onto the lid a little bit. Blend it into the blue a little bit more. And try to blend it into the pink. Alright, now I'm going to add my brow highlight and I'm going to take my MAC 227 and I'm going to take my L'Oreal True Match in Natural Beige W4 and um, just going to get a little on the brush, go under my brow. and blend it down. Now I'm going to come in with this ivory color right here. And apply that on my brow bone. 